What's up guys, Zinger Banjo here. We're playing more Persona 4 Golden right now on PC. And we've hit that spot in the game. We just took down Adachi. We just took down the big evil bad god person thing. And we got two text messages here. Uh, it's Christmas Eve tomorrow. So this is we have this big date thing that we need to set up for. And we're gonna, obviously going to confirm with Yukiko. There's no way we're going to pick anyone else. Yukiko is best girl. Problem solved. We don't have a uh, 23rd. It's going to go right to the 24th here. My parents booted me out of the house tonight. I was helping out like normal, but my parents said I was bothering them. They're being overprotective. I can go out on a date without any help. <laughs> but I like them so much. Oh, thanks for the cake. It looks really delicious. By the way, I have a present for you. You won't be staying in Inaba forever. I want you to take that when you go, for me, since I'm going to be staying here, in this town. Hmm. <laughs> I should stop talking about gloomy stuff like that. We've solved the case. I want today to be fun. Hmm. I've been wondering why I like you. You're so confident. At first I was interested in you. When I realized that, I was already going after you. It's tough that you'll be leaving, but I have to accept the truth. Um, what else do people do during Christmas? Vienna's always busy during this time of year, so I've never spent a Christmas night like this before. I've never had a boyfriend either. I'm so happy that you're my first boyfriend. Hmm. Hmm. That's not the first time I've had that thought. Hmm? Um. Huh? Can I stay here tonight? Uh, I told my mother that I'd spend the night at Chie's place. So I can stay here without anyone minding. I... I love you. So the case is closed for reals this time. I think we can safely leave the rest to the police. Adachi has confessed his crimes, so I'm sure Namatame's presumed guilt will be re-examined as well. I see. Then that really wraps it up. What do you do now, Teddy? You're not going back over there, are you? You better not, you dumb bear. You don't know how much you worried us last time. I won't suddenly disappear like that again. Damn straight you won't. Man, just stay here, all right? like they're letting Nanako come home for a bit. She's awake again, and she's got a good amount of strength back, too. If all goes well, she might be able to leave the hospital for the time being. And as for me, they said I just needed to see a doctor regularly. So I'm planning to come home with Nanako today. Sorry I had to stick you with all the housework. I'll make up for it somehow. And Really? Nanako-chan's coming home? I'm so happy for her. Me too. I'm really glad. The fog's all gone over here because everyone tried so hard. And now Nanako-chan's gotten better. Nanako-chan tried hard too. She... She's such an amazing girl. <laughs> C 
seriously. Thank heavens she's okay. Sure, Nana chan will be delighted! We'll need a cake then. G guys, please say you're not gonna. Huh? We're gonna make one. Of course, we're gonna make one. I've already researched the ingredients. Hey, wait! Wait a sec, whoa there! That's way too tall an order for you! Let's go to the grocery department! Come on, Natto-kun, you too! B but I've never baked a cake. Don't worry, neither have we! This is the fabled Kotatsu. I was really looking forward to the new Kotatsu. Yeah, you talked about it all the time at the hospital. Nanako needs to go back for a full checkup early next year, but if they don't find anything wrong, they'll let her go immediately. If I'd gotten better sooner, we would have been able to buy the Katatsu together. Sorry. I don't mind, since Big Bro and everyone came to rescue me. Sorry for the wait! Oh no, the Christmas edition of Mystery Food X is about to be served. Bring it on, I'm ready. Got my insurance card and everything. <laughs> it's a cake! Hey, this is bigger than I imagined. Wait, Nanako-chan! I'll be the first one to... No! It's delicious! It tastes really good! Th that can't be... No. Has she lost all sense of taste? Did you guys really make this? Huh? Of course we did! Does it actually taste like something? It's not hot, is it? How is it, Kanji? Hmm? It, it's amazing! You know what they say about true talent not needing to show off. Turns out we had good taste in cooking after all. Then again, this one was our third attempt. Hey, Yosuke!
Sasuke, Chie-chan and the others really are talented chefs. Three stars for sure. I impossible. This actually tastes good. Wait, I didn't already pass out, did I? This isn't a dream, right? Um, Nana-chan, guess what I have? Ta-da! A Christmas present for you! Oh, it looks just like you! I wish I could have made it look better. But I thought it'd keep you company at the hospital, Nana-chan. Oh, and it's made from 100% pure teddy fur. I'm a guy who's all about using all natural materials. Isn't that nice of him, Nanako? Teddy fur. Uh-huh. Thank you, Teddy. I have to thank you all again. Adachi confessed to the two murders. He insists it was him who hung the bodies, too. There are still things that are unclear about his story, but he's most likely going to pay for his crimes. Anyway, this was one strange case. what you said about a world inside the TV was true, then everything might make sense. Oh, I still don't believe it. Some things in this world just can't be explained. Like Nanako. She made a miraculous recovery, and now she's as healthy as ever. Back in the day, my own senpai on the forest told me something. There's an underside to everything that you can never see. This case has made me think about a lot of things. You've helped us out so much. <laughs> it was meant to be the other way around, really. There isn't much time left until spring, but I hope I can do some catching up until then. That's right. You're only here until spring, huh? Senpai, you're going back? It won't be the same without you. Sensei? Are you going somewhere? Don't forget, there are people waiting for you. When you get home, show your parents how much you've grown this past year. And then if they're okay with it, you can come back here at any time. Come on, spring's a long ways off, right? Let's have all the fun we can until then. Hey, don't get too carried away. My sis would kill me if you got yourself held back a year. Oh, but then you wouldn't have to go back, huh? Wow, if that happened... I'd be in the same grade as Senpai. Yo! 
Yeah, it looks like the holiday season is kind of over. Not really kind of over. We had a nice little Christmas Eve with uh, Yukiko, the best girl in the game. And we had Christmas Day with uh, Dojima and the investigation crew. Everything is all wrapped up nice and neatly. Now, if this was a regular, the vanilla version of Persona 4, the game would most likely be uh, reaching its uh, conclusion where you would get a time skip. And then on top of that, we would reach the final end where we'd say goodbye to everybody. But this is Persona 4 Golden that has additional content. We should have met all the requirements for unlocking uh, the extra content. Uh, to say the least. Uh, and it's funny that <laughs> they're having a vacation uh, right about now. And we just had Christmas. Weird that they go to school the, the day after Christmas and then they're right off. That's just, to me, that's just comical. Uh, personally speaking, uh, from my personal standpoint there. So we have our end of term assembly and everything along those lines before we can kind of be off. I don't know how long they're actually off for. I know they're not off for like a whole month uh, like they were in the summer, and I know it's not going to be like a couple days, like a week or so. I can't say for certain. I'm not 100% sure, but we we really won't have much time for the uh, foreseeable future in terms of completing social links and doing other events. We should have almost all of our social links completed at this time. If you guys didn't notice, Sadashi's at rank 9 now after we defeat him. So Welcome if back. you're wondering if that'll rank up uh, to 10, it all depends on which ending we get and certain choices we make. So I want to keep that in mind. That is still there. I know we still have one or two more social links left. We pretty much have maybe just as athletes is the one we have to focus on right now. That would be the only school social link we have left. I we did rank up Yumi previously. I'm trying to recall all the social links we have maxed up. And right now it is raining, so we're going to see if anything's going to pop up on the Midnight Channel. Highly unlikely, but let's find out anyway. I just got off the phone with Chie. Have you checked your TV? For you either? I didn't see any glow or anything. It's definitely raining outside, though. Does this mean the Midnight Channel's off the air? I'm being serious here. Now that we beat that Amino Sagiri, the case is completely over, right? Oh, uh, thanks. <laughs> I should be the one thanking you, though. Yeah, all of us together, we did it. Man, all these things are coming back to me, like when I put you on the spot and asked you to be our leader. <laughs> what am I getting all worked up for? The others must all be super happy right now, too. I bet Chi is practically crying her eyes out. All right, I'll call you again later. Seriously, though. Thanks. And now the game kind of fast forwards us to New Year's. So we're actually going to get ready for our New Year's celebration with the investigation crew. Uh, we're going to get there in a few seconds. Uh, it'll be interesting because we have New Year's Eve and New Year's Day. And then I think we might have another time skip. So we get to the point of the game where we're going to have a lot of time skips. Mainly because we don't really need to be doing all the stuff here. So let's head over for New Year's Eve celebration with the investigation team. <laughs> Sorry. Whew. Sorry to keep you waiting. Wait, huh? Is it just you here, senpai? Seriously? This is the time we all decided on, isn't it? I was watching TV at home, but it seems like I fell asleep. When I woke up, that New Year's show, Toshi Koshi Kuro Toshi, had already started, so I rushed out here. Sorry we're late. Hellos! I'm sorry, Sensei. It's all Yosuke's fault. Come on, Yosuke! You owe Sensei a full apology for making us late! Me? 
It was 100% your fault. But I am sorry about making you wait. We had an emergency at work. Everyone had to refill all of the lucky draw bags. We just finished a second ago. Because a certain someone just crammed a bunch of stuff into the bags without checking any of the prices! about you, you little... Moving on! Hey, Sensei, where's Nana-chan and her dad? You doofus. You can't come out on a cold night like this. Dojima-san and Nanako-chan just got temporarily released from the hospital for the holidays. They aren't healed yet. Well then, where's everyone else? Why are only the guys here? D don't tell me. Is this going to be some lame guys night celebration? <laughs> No lovely girls? Hell no! But man, they're late. They should have gotten here a while ago. What if they're all meeting up at Yukiko-senpai's house first? You know, like to put on their kimonos? K kimonos Did you hear that, S -s -s sensei Kimonos! Right, we don't know anything. Don't get all worked up for kimonos yet, Teddy. Kimonos! I might go into Kodiak arrest! Ugh, this guy. Although I must say, seeing Reset in a kimono would be quite a sight. Whoa, maybe Naoto's in one too. Okay, now I'm starting to get a little... I'm sorry about the wait. Sorry. We went to buy some heating packs and ended up running late. We're sorry. Uh. Huh. Uh. What's with the non reaction? What? Where are your kimonos? Why would I be in a kimono? We aren't going to be out long enough to bother with putting one on. See, that's what I thought. I told you all that from the beginning. Ow, my ears! You got your hopes up on your own? Don't take it out on us! A girl has to save her best outfits for the moments that count the most. Huh? A kimono's one of a girl's best outfits? Wait, you're implying that you're out of our league. She wasn't implying. My heart just froze over. Um, shouldn't we be more mindful of the time? If we don't hurry, we'll have to do the countdown here at the entrance. Oh no! We're going to miss the two-year shrine visit! This is my first time being with friends on midnight of New Year's Day! I'd always just spent it with everyone at the inn until last year. Actually... I'm glad we were all able to celebrate today here peacefully. Yeah. All right, everyone, let's get going. <sighs> Staying still makes me cold. They're handing out Amazaki over there. Uh uh. Not till New Year's. Hey, how huh? long till next year? Uh. Oh. oh, it's almost time. <laughs> Three, two, two one! one. <laughs> Happy, Happy New Year! Year! I'm glad we're here together. New Year's here! Finally, the New Year's here! Let's make this year a great oh, Happy New Year, this both year of you. Too, partner. Thank you! <laughs> it's not your <laughs> celebration. <laughs> nope, none for you, Rise. <laughs> what? And the same goes for you, Yukiko. Oh, come on, just let it go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's snowing! Wow. Oh. <laughs> told you it was cold. Do you think the snow will pile up? This is what they call a white New Year's, huh? No one calls it that. It's a new year, but you're still Moranji. What? Moranji. Oh. Well, hey, hey, what are you nodding for? <laughs> <laughs> Moranji! 
Shut up. <laughs>